I think my main question for the leaders of today is for myself running and, and having founded a startup, been running for two and a half years now, we're in a lot of, I have a lot of challenges in terms of raising capital and raising funds. So I think my main question is how do I focus on capital for purpose, for example, and how to deploy capital towards a social goal and how do I work with corporates to do that when I spend a lot of time raising that capital and a lot of time deploying that capital just to really survive as an entrepreneur and keep the growth business running um, as opposed to having an opportunity to think about social good uh, and deploying that capital in other ways. So I think that's my main question. Okay. Well, thank you for this very important question. I think the entrepreneurial impact on making change happen has always been um, great and important, but has never been as important as today. Why? Um, because the questions are so big um, that we need real innovation uh, to answer them and to answer them in the required speed. At the same time, the bigger the innovation um, is and needs to be, um, the riskier it is to test and to, to learn what actually works. And VC money or financers of, of startups have a tendency to somehow balance their risks, right? At some point they need to get their money back. Um, so we need to look for, for VC funding um, that acknowledges the fact that they might have to invest into longer term um, periods as much as foundations can support that process, uh, stage money can support that process. And the good news is that I truly believe the most important uh, pitch deck page on our entrepreneurial uh, slides for the future will be to which of the UN SDGs we are actually contributing with our um, innovations. So the desire for solutions in the market, in society, and also in the financial sector is so big that the money will flow, flow where the intelligence um, solutions are offered. Um, so I think it takes a little bit of of, um, well, it takes, you need to be brave to offer those solutions and to be, to be, um, have the self-esteem to say, yes, I'm, I'm capable to do that and to reach this uh, high goal. And the moment you believe in yourself as an entrepreneur is, is where it starts and where people start believing in you and this is where the money will flow. I truly believe that. I'm a tech entrepreneur for 15 years now and that always worked for my life. So uh, I'm sure and I hope it will um, for, for many other entrepreneurs too.